Hi everybody and welcome to the N Channel video blog and today what I want to talk about is Klein vs. Wear screwdrivers. Now both these screwdrivers are amazing, you can't go wrong with either brand, but there is one factor that I think really stands out for these is the fact that they are screwdrivers and what I mean by that is the tips of any screwdriver will eventually round out. And so that is a huge point when we're actually looking at tools because I will admit that these tools will not likely last my lifetime. Sure the standard screwdrivers can be reground and continuously remade. But for something like the Robinson or the Phillips screwdriver, it's not really easy to do that, though it is feasible. So what I really want to stress on the first point, and probably the most major point, is the price per quality. And the Weir right here is an amazing tool, but it's really amazing for its price range. Now, for a set of six of these on Amazon.com, is $32.04, or $5.34 on average per handle. Where if you take a look at the Klein, you're paying $81.77 for a set of seven. That means you're paying $11.68, and that's more than double the price of the Weira. And the Weira also comes electrically insulated, so if you're into electronics or electrical work, this is going to be your clear winner for just price quality and the sense of electrical insulation. Because if you want the insulated version of a Klein tool, you're paying $37.99 per two screwdrivers, and so that works out to be $19 a handle. Now one huge variable that we got to factor in when we're actually purchasing screwdrivers is the comfort of them. And what I mean by that is the ergonomics that goes into the handles. Now what we got here is the Klein. Now the Klein's got the rubber over it and it's got a nice placement for your thumb and all that, but the rest of your hand is not really accommodated for. And what I mean is the cylindrical shape here doesn't adhere to your body well. Where the Weir, they really spent some time in developing one of the most comfortable handles I've ever worked with. And what it does is actually adheres to your body in a really nice way. So when you're using this for extended periods of time, it really doesn't cause any stress on your body that isn't needed, and it really gives you the ability to work longer and harder. Now one extreme subtle detail about this tool is it's hexagonal. And what that means is when you have this on your bench or on top of your toolbox, it's less likely to roll away on you because the geometry it has to overcome in order to roll. And it's just one of those little subtle details that makes this tool stand out just a little bit more. Now one great thing about the abundance of tool makers is they're in an ongoing competition between one another. Innovations are well rewarded by customers buying their products. Now Weir has done something here to overcome their competition, and they've put a laser groove in there. And what that laser tip actually does is offer more traction between you and the screw. So that little subtle feature on the tool is going to offer a lot of advantages. So let's actually analyze that and see the pros of actually having that incorporated in your tool. Now the benefit of actually creating those laser edges is that you're actually making a whole bunch of sharp surfaces. And all these little tiny surfaces actually allow you to apply more traction with less effort to the actual screw. So let's see this in action and see the benefit of actually doing this to a tool. Now to actually generate the traction, you don't need as much force. So that means you're going to have less slippage. So your work surface is going to be a lot cleaner and there's less jeopardy of hurting yourself as the operator of the tool. Now, there's also one other advantage. If you're working on a rusted out system or an oily surface, it's not as hard to actually generate that traction needed to actually withdraw that screw. Now, one thing I love about Klein tools is their durability in their product. And one of the reasons why I believe they're so durable is the fact they got this really heavy duty chrome finish on this. And if you're someone that works out in a little bit more harsh chemicals or outdoors a lot, or it's just generally rough to their tools, even them outside, this is what's really going to prolong the use of them is the fact that they actually have resilience to oxidization just by a simple coating. Now the winner between the two manufacturers is Weira. And first off, it's the ergonomics they're taking into account. They're wonderful to work with and over prolonged use, it's going to be really comfortable to you as a user. Next off is the finish that they're putting on the tips of these. And what that means is you're going to have less problems removing oxidized screws as well as applying more torsion to it as well as just even getting the screws to the job. And finally, and probably the most important aspect to actually take into account is the price per quality. Like I said, these tools will wear out faster than any other tool because of their excessive use and just the fact that that's what they are. So it's good to know that you can replace these for a reasonable fee. Anyways guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Enjoy your week.